Hi, my name is Simpson Wong and I'm a chef. And I am Dr. Henry Wu. I'm a cardiologist. Today I'm going to make a hot healthy meal that um, Dr. Wu will approve. Oh, sure. You also had a heart attack before, so I'm sure you know what is good for your heart. Kind of, actually. Um, so what are you cooking? I'm making a seafood stew, like Asian seafood stew. It's like a bouillabaisse, Asian bouillabaisse, but um, you know, with different kind of seafood and all the yumminess inside. Mm, that's great. What What's in the uh, stew? Um, so basically, I will start with the, the paste, you know, there's a paste that I will make, you know, I don't know whether you can see from here. This is galanga, and there's ginger, and there's turmeric. Be careful of turmeric because it stains your fingers. It's like a, 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 a henna tattoo. And of course, garlic, and some shallots, and some lemongrass, which I use it up for um, this paste here, which is, um, you know, so that's what makes it um, Asian, I guess. Great. What kind of fish are you going to use? Oh, I'm going to use a uh, hick. Um, so hick is a white flaky fish. Um, it's from um, the water, uh, the ocean. So it's wild caught fish. Great. Well, fish is really good for the heart because of the uh, omega-3 fatty acids uh, content. It is, it yes, is, yes, yes. yes. Uh, but why, why particularly, hey, can I use tuna? You can, but the thing is that uh, I just learned a lesson to, uh, just uh, a few months ago that, you know, I found out that I am like um, diagnosed with high uh, mercury level, like uh, toxicity, basically. My mercury wow. level is like 51. Wow. So what is the normal? Uh, wow, you're not supposed to have any. Right, right, zero, right? Zero, so yes. it's, uh, I went for a blood test and then so the blood work came back and so... so well, that's from eating fish. You yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat a lot of fish? Yeah, yeah, totally. Yes. Oh, wow. so, okay. so, so my, my uh, mercury toxicity level was like so high that I got a letter from the Department of Health to tell me to monitor it and, you know, because, I mean, that's why I had all these like... Uh, neck pain and I couldn't lose any weight and things wow. like that. Yeah. It's so, uh, ironic, you're trying to be healthy and then now you have mercury toxicity. Yeah, so I, you know, I, ha I had a heart attack uh, when I was 42, which is like 15 years ago. Next week will uh, we'll make um, 15 years anniversary of my heart attack. I don't want to celebrate that day, but the, so so I, I, I'm always eating healthy even before my heart attack. So. Um, for that, I've been eating a lot of like omega-3 pack um, oily fish. Like um, when I have money, I will splurge on tuna and halibut and swordfish, which are more expensive. But uh, when I'm running out of money, so what I do is like I will eat like cheaper fish like mackerel and bluefish. I, I like them all, you know, they're all so good, you know, it, it depends on how you prepare them. But then those fish, has the highest level of mercury. So you don't want that. You want something like the heck because these are delicious and it has omega-3, but without the mercury, a little bit. Yes, that's right. You want to avoid the, the large fatty fish like swordfish and the tuna and macro, those are the big ones, right? That's As, bad for you. Exactly. Okay. So I think What about that, uh, shrimp? Well, the thing is that there will be um, 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 so you for mm -hmm. the for the stew, you know, you need to have some shellfish. I know that you say, oh, you had a heart attack, so you know, is shellfish usually has a lot of like cholesterol. But the thing is that I know uh, my understanding is like you know, shellfish even though it has a little higher cholesterol, but it has zero fat the bad fat for you. So, which is uh, better correct. than eating a piece of chicken, or chicken That's thigh, correct. or yes. lamb, or beef, or pork, you know? So, yes. right? It's, it's a common Doctor? misconception that, you know, you cannot eat seafood because of the high cholesterol level, but you can really, good, it's such a small amount, you can eat seafood because there are other benefits. Yeah, exactly. So um, I think that uh, before we go uh, uh, to cook, uh, and so um, 
Can I ask you a question? Because uh, you are doing, uh, besides uh, uh, seeing patients who has a heart problem, but you also uh, uh, sometimes um, see patients who has like uh, mercury toxicity. How do you get rid of the mercury in your body? Well, the first step is to avoid the, the, the <laughs> kind of fish that obviously, has a lot of mercury. Obviously. Obviously. The second <laughs> is to, uh, there are uh, pills that you can take, they call CLG, that uh, can remove the mercury uh, from your uh, bloodstream. Uh huh, okay. And then if oh, you. Well, it's are, good for this time of the, you know, during the pandemic, so, you know, right? Yes. So you can just take it at home. Yes. Okay. Um, the third point, if you have very high level, a lot of symptoms, we will give you an IV treatment to, to take out, to draw out the mercury okay. from your blood. Okay. Um, the other thing you can do is to have a sauna to sweat it out. Oh, yes. that's interesting. Yes. By sweating it out? Yes. But what sweating kind of sauna? Just a regular... Regular sauna is good, but the sauna. best kind is an infrared sauna which now oh. you can find in the city. But obviously now is not the time to, to go for <laughs> inter inter infrared sauna. So true, so true. Okay, so I think that we're gonna go ahead and cook this uh, uh, delicious dish. We're gonna start cooking right now. Um, see, the thing is that now we have a little bit of like, um, you know, uh, sweating a little bit of onions and a little bit of garlic in there in a coconut oil, a mixture of this uh, organic coconut oil and you get the creaminess from it, but without the fat actually the, from the coconut milk and a little bit of canola oil. So we're gonna add a little bit of bell pepper to give it a little sweetness. And we're gonna throw in the clam. And some corn. And, and it's the paste, the paste that is with uh, turmeric. So the wonderful thing about turmeric is because it's anti-inflammatory. So, you know, so this is a really, really good for you. So it's considered as a um, uh, 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 it's considered as a superfood. So whenever you can get your hand into some turmeric, you should do it. So, and then, so, then we are adding a little bit of fish sauce, a little bit of this chili, if you would like your food spicy, and some tamarind for tanginess. And a little bit of sugar. If, if, you don't, if you cannot take sugar, that's fine. Just don't add them. So, you know. Oh my god, this is already smelling so amazing. You know, the turmeric. Turmeric is very, it tastes like a root vegetable. So, you need all these, like, you know, hot tamarinds and then the spices to bring it alive, you know. So, um, the next thing I'm going to put is a little bit of like water. You can put uh, uh, chicken stock, but then I prefer just simple, simple water, water. So I'm going to add the fish now. And glass noodles, the saffron noodles. And a little bit of like squid, fresh local squid from uh, from Long Island, and a little bit of shrimp. We have six shrimps there. So at this point, I'm going to just uh, cover it with a lid. So to finish it off, I'm going to add a little bit of like um, lime juice. I love limes. 
is it gives it the, 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 the uh, acidic taste, you know. Uh, it's different from the tamarind because, you know, it gives it a life. And the last thing that I'm going to add is some herbs, some aromatic. You can use scallions, you can use basil and things like that. I, but I think that this is, this dish is, look at the, the, the hake, is beautiful. Uh, this dish is perfect with um, a cilantro. So here, there you have it. Um, so it's Asian seafood stew that is super healthy for you, for your mercury level, and for your heart health. Enjoy.